The so-called Epstein lists are now becoming public. Jeffrey Epstein was a wealthy financier who allegedly killed himself in prison in 2019 while under investigation for recruiting girls to provide sexual services for his high-profile friends. Documents from a lawsuit against Epstein's accomplice, Elaine Maxwell, revealed names of those with connections to Epstein, from former presidents Clinton and Trump to Prince Andrew and multiple Hollywood stars. None is accused of any wrongdoing. John, any political or legal ramifications? Do we need to see more? Well, I'll tell you what surprised me in all of this. We learned that Jeffrey Epstein's airplane is the only plane in America that Michael Kelly has never flown on. <laughs> uh, so that, that was the big takeaway for me. You know, the people that associated with him after 2008 when he was convicted for inappropriate sexual activity with minors, I do think they've got some explaining to do. Do we need to see more? Is this... It. Well, might as well throw it all out there. There's too sexy of names. You've got two former presidents that are involved in it. It's more information is good. Sunlight, sunlight. Now to our quote of the week. The return of mask mandates to St. Louis lasted less than a day. With cases of COVID-19, flu, and RSV all spiking now, a masking mandate was issued for the city of St. Louis and its employees. Mayor Tashara Jones said the reason for that was because a healthy workforce is required to provide sufficient city services. Well, she rethought that and pulled back the mandate, saying in our quote of the week, our administration moved to a recommended, not mandated policy for masking upon further review. She did not say why, Michael. Should she because, say why? Because the health director put this out without her knowledge. Um, and that, I think, speaks to the bigger problem. Number one, we're going back in time to 2021, 2021, going to live through that again. We know better. We do better. This masking stuff, enough already. There's nobody in charge of the city of St. Louis. Nobody's keeping an eye on the store. But if you put it out there and you say, we have to have this to have a healthy city workforce to provide city services, and then in the same statement you say, yeah, but we don't have to have it really, doesn't that present a credibility issue should masking actually become needed again well i don't think you need the masks to have a credibility issue at city hall uh you know this is i think they were waxing nostalgic andy for the good old days of 2020 when we were shutting down businesses and making people wear masks this was a really really bad idea and it is shocking to me that supposedly the mayor didn't know this was going out how do you how are you running a city if the mayor doesn't know that their health director is putting a mask mandate in effect, that's, uh, that seems to be a bit ridiculous to me. Final thoughts are next. First, Bomberito.com drone fox over wonderful Lafayette Park in South St. Louis. Look at that, looking northeast toward the fabulous St. Louis skyline.